Well, cleanup it does continue today in Wissanoming after a huge fire destroyed a discount store. Some folks who live nearby say that water from that firefight flooded their homes. Madeline Wright spoke to one of those residents. Andre Campbell shows us the damage to his basement after a fire at the Dollar Tree next door. He says all the water firefighters used to put out the flames created a river that flooded his bedroom and laundry room. It was so bad. Everything flooded out in the basement, bed, dresser. The water was right at my knee. The fire at the discount store on Frankfurt Avenue broke out around 3 o'clock Sunday afternoon. The Dollar Tree is on the other side of this fence. The water flowed down the hill, across the alleyway, and right into Campbell's driveway and garage. The pump up the water, call the landlord, I'm mean, going to send someone right now, something else to go to smoke inside the house. As the fire raged, nearby residents were told to evacuate. Well, my mom called me. She was coughing because there was so much smoke coming from the uh, from the back of the fire right into our house. Monday afternoon, workers tore down part of the building, and the ATF was on scene as investigators worked to determine the cause of the fire. Well, I'm a little sad about the store. You know, it was our neighborhood store. It was very convenient for us. It was right here. As for Campbell, his clothes, baby toys, and other belongings are soaked. He says he has to stay at a hotel due to smoke and water damage. Crazy. Of the pay hundred and fifty a night. I reached out to the city of Philadelphia to see if they offer compensation in cases like these. I'm still waiting to hear back. Campbell says he doesn't have renter's insurance, but he's working with his landlord to determine his options. In Wissanoming, Madeline Wright, CBS News, Philadelphia.